Hey y'all, I Rick Sky here, and this is the monopod like I use fully extended. And I've got that's kind of cool, isn't it? I've got it fully extended, 5K30 hyper smooth, but no boost. Now, obviously, you can see the pole within this shot. Uh, that may not be optimal for uh, you know for your filming situation, but I just want to show you how it looks if this monopod's fully extended. What I like about this particular monopod is it's very sturdy and also this particular monopod i can use in salt water you get the more compact monopods they tend to be a little bit shaky this one's very rigid and again i'm also able to put it in salt water if i want to and not have to worry about uh you know about corrosion you know obviously i'll wash the salt water off of it but you know for the most part it's probably not going to corrode so there's an advantage to using this type of monopod versus the ultralight ultra portable monopods but just want to show you the type of results you can get and again this is in 5k 30 with hyper smooth um, but you know the monopod smooths the footage out and then you put hyper smooth stabilization on top of that it's pretty much pretty much just as good as a mechanical gimbal and you don't have the additional batteries to fumble with you don't have the additional thing you got to pack you know the gimbal <laughs> so i don't know i've enjoyed it what do you think about the quality comment below and when you do ring that bell icon to subscribe and subscribe and uh that'll notify you whenever i post another video so hope this looks good again taking it to the appalachian trail that'll be the real test so stay tuned y'all have a good day hey y'all captain irix guy here i hope y'all enjoyed this video if you did please be sure to subscribe it's youtube.com forward slash irix guy and ring that bell icon when you do to be notified whenever i post another video Thanks for your viewership and y'all have a good day.